What's going on, y'all? Jimmy Macklem here. Hope the season two, episode nine of The Leftovers. Last we saw, Kevin escaped from that, whatever the fuck that was, death by killing uh, Patty. Jesus. Let's get to it. be disappointed because whatever it is that you're about to tell me is fucking bullshit. Walnuts. What? Your mother sent the salad back because she asked for no walnuts. She was very polite about it though. <laughs> Are you sure you want to know? I'm, I'm, I'm sure most of you won't know, or I'm sure any of you won't know. None of you will know. Uh oh. When did Eddie Winslow become a great actor? Well. Was he always a great actor? I don't he know. wasn't the real deal. Liar. She must have been heartbreaking. Or boring as fuck. Never mind, it's pointless. <laughs> That's what she tells her dad, right? Fucking hysterical. I'm eating. What about the bus? If you want to have a conversation, let's just have a conversation. She's awesome. Why do I have to just stand there when I can put my cigarette out in their fucking eye? That's a reminder. Violence is weakness. You're wrong. You can count on me. Can we, Megan? Because we counted on you to handle this. We lost 10 members from New Rochelle last week. Apparently, he's hugging their pain away. I wanted to do what he could do. Oh, I wanted to be something. Where is this going? So I said yes. I'm so concerned. What did Meg do? His arm. Who wants a hug? It's Meg, right? Take your pain away, Meg. I can do this for real.
You figured you would pimp out your own fucking son so that you wouldn't have to run people over anymore. So that you didn't have to feel bad about leaving your whole fucking family. Tommy. Tommy, please. I'm sorry. I tried to recruit you. You look so sad. Then you blew your fucking whistle on me. You blew the whistle, and they came and put me in a fucking van that brought me to Meg. Hmm? Meg. You know Meg? You know Meg? Huh? You know her? Where's your whistle? Where's your whistle? Where's your fucking whistle? Where is it? Where is that whistle? Man, Tommy's lost it. I feel so bad. I just so happen to be headed there myself. <laughs> she <Jeez. laughs> Tell me. Somebody got on the property. Oh, it's gonna be somebody we know. Explosives? What, what did I see? I didn't see anything. I don't even know what you're talking about. We can just keep him here until tomorrow. Once it's over, it won't matter anymore. Did she kidnap those fucking girls? Good for you. So Kevin and Nora have been taking care of Mary, and I'm immensely grateful for that. So the Rangers just won't let you in? Their rules are very particular. Wow. That doesn't seem fair. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I can't get over it. They're just not suffering like the rest of us are. That feels something. You know, Megan, I don't think you're being entirely honest with me. You think I'd lie to a priest? Well, then I apologize for being your living reminder. <laughs> Matt is the man, and that's that. You want me to tell you? Yes. You're waiting for me.
that was episode nine of The Leftovers. Where to begin? I'll fucking tell you where to begin. Whether she actually qualifies as a villain, I don't know. Eh, it's up in the air. We'll see. But I'm going to say yes. Well, at least an antagonist for this episode. You know, she's kind of the pro to Listen, fuck it. You know what I'm saying. How fantastic is Meg? When did Liv Tyler become so good? Maybe she's always had that kind of dead look in her eyes and just kind of works for this. Holy shit. She was frightening. She was scary. She, she, there's this, she's definitely had some kind of fucking psychotic break. There's something off in her brain. Wow. The fucking girls are not missing. They went with Meg, apparently, and they want to be there. Why the fuck the door lock? I don't know. Anyway. Um... But you get a bunch of fucking silent guys walking around. You don't want anybody to get raped, I guess. Fair enough. And it went... Holy shit. Um, once I started, we were following Meg. And we weren't, um... <clears throat> gonna fucking catch up after Kevin left the grave. I was highly annoyed. And then it just turned out to be an amazing... I don't want to say character study, but in the, just an hour of following somebody else. Damn, I loved her. I'm sorry. I just do. I love her. Um, but we still have this thing up in the air where Kevin's fingerprint. I assume John's going to snap. I hope somebody sees these girls. I hope this fucking Meg... I hope she doesn't kill him, which I think is entirely possible. They'll be on the bridge and burn or whatever the fuck. Some kind of weird sacrifice. Just like people get stoned in the face. Anyway, um, what was I going to say? I think that's it. There's nothing else to say. Post your comments down. Oh, wait a minute. Matt. I said a couple episodes ago. I, I said a couple episodes ago, Matt is really good at reading people. And he did it again, because that's what he does. He's a goddamn gangster. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.